Good morning, people. Good morning, people. It is morning here. This morning, the drone is over there. Yeah. Yeah. We took it out the other day, but then we saw that we didn't record the footage, so <laughs> we're doing it again. We were so excited sending up the drone. The first that was our first day. Yeah. First day, and we were just looking at the monitor, and then today we realized that we didn't press record. Yeah. You know. Yeah. She she's still in transition of yeah. sleeping and awake. <laughs> so let's get it. We're gonna um not so sure what we're gonna do today. No, um we've got we're a gonna, we're gonna go to the fish market. Jim Baran fish market is today, didn't Let's just make it spontaneous and we'll yeah. fill you guys in or whatever as we do. So let's go get this drone up and running. So we decided to go to the beach. And this is Malasti Beach. About to send off the drone. It's there. Oh, there's a sun lounge in here. And there's the drone. my reflection thinking about what you mentioned it was supposed to be the one to take every last pain away nothing on our loving maybe time told us that we were different did it break you down into this Malasti beach is 5,000 rupiah each so that's 10,000 and you pay an extra 2,000 rupiah for I guess parking the bike yeah I would say so all in all that's uh, 1,200 rupiah yeah is that right? <laughs> just ignore me <laughs> You pay so about 12,000 12, 12, 12, rupees, sorry. Um, 80 cents. Yeah, about 80, 80, 80 cents. And we had to pay for these chairs, which I, I think they conned us a bit, you know, because these women there who are, who you'll see there, they control the seating and they, you know, they ask you every single thing under the sun and get on your nerves a little bit. So we may buy a coconut from these women. And anyway, so these chairs cost 100,000 rupiah, which is about seven dollars. That's about three dollars per three three dollars fifty per chair. And yeah, you can stay as long as you like. So I guess it's okay, you know, not so bad, you know. Um, yeah, being as it's not attached to our hotel, our villa, so. You know, you expect to pay something, so that's not too bad. Yeah, so everything under ten dollars. So yeah, next time we'll probably uh, bring some drinks because we didn't bring any drinks, but we only live up there, so we can go back and get some, right? We got bintang in the we got bintang in the fridge. For the yes. Yeah. Yeah. Just flown the drone. Here's the bass for all of you that doesn't know. <laughs> that, that, that is the miniature 
of our of the big dream. Hopefully one day it will get to the point of owning our own private jet to be called Air Sebas. I haven't got into the water yet, came here to actually go into the water, so gonna get gonna get wet in a minute. Um, take some pictures of Wife for Life of course. We're about to get wet. Wife for Life is behind me, of course, as always. That's cold. That is cold. I'm taking a big risk here with my camera because I don't know how powerful these waves are. But doing it for the vlog, I'm definitely, definitely not gonna drop this camera. Woo -wee! It is cold. All right, let's do some photos. He says, if you're from Jamaica, you definitely did not come here for the beach. <laughs> yeah, no, he did say that to me. I mean, we saw, we seen the beaches, but I mean, we came here for the experience of Asia, yeah. not so much um, the beaches. I mean, if you want, to, if you want beaches, you go to Jamaica, you go to Mexico. You know, we'll go to Caribbean, period. We're born with natural tans. So, the idea is gonna chill here for about half, half an hour, 20 minutes, then head home to the pool. Yes. Yeah, yeah, the pool is, the pool is, the beach is okay, but I mean, comparing to beaches that we're used to, the beach is a bit too stony for me. A lot of coral and stones. Yeah, no, it's not easy to walk, you know. So, uh, you know, if you're white and you want to tan, this is an ideal place to be. Plus, it's almost free, you know. But um, for black people who are looking for beaches, especially if you're from the Caribbean, or, you know, you have ties to the Caribbean, this is not a beach for you, you know. But the, the scene, not taking away no credit from it, the scene is beautiful, you know, I got some good drone shots, you know, so other than, other than walking and the stones in your feet, if you take that away, it's a beautiful place. You know, it's a beautiful place. And uh, a note if you come in here, get your own drinks, pack a little... Yeah, if you're coming to the Molasta Beach, just pack your own drinks because they're selling coconut and water and everything. But even though we haven't purchased any yet, you kind of know yeah. what that's going to be like. You know? And um, come with a little bit of tolerance for the people who are selling little ornaments, you know, because they, they're a little overbearing, but, you know, it's a free beach. <laughs> you know, I expect that. Nice and slow. What for life gonna do her thing? Nice and slow.
Okay. Do the reverse. Let go of the brakes. Keep coming back. She got this. Yeah. Yee. Got it like that. Okay. She got it. All right. <laughs> Hope you got that down to a T. No, not yet. I don't know what down to a T. <laughs> I got a got a basic understanding of it. Yeah, it does take a. A bit of getting used to, but yeah, that's how it's done. Whew, so hot, nerve wracking, but I guess once you keep driving it, you get used to it. So, here we go. Okay, did about an hour at the beach, but like we we're saying, you know. If you're from Jamaica or Jamaica affiliated or Caribbean affiliated, Bali is nice, but it's not somewhere that you would come for the sole purpose of the beaches, you know, because compared to beaches in the Caribbean, Bali cannot be compared. But the culture is nice, the people are nice, um, and you can afford a villa like this for, I mean, it's, it's very affordable. You know, it depends on your taste, it depends on your style. The advantage of Bali is that people can find accommodation from as little as 10 US per night, you know, to um, hundreds per night, depending on your taste. But anything over, anything over 70 US dollars per night is considered top of the line yeah. you know um, a villa like this you probably could get it for 100 120 a night depending on the season depending on the season and depending mm -hmm. on the time of travel exactly. you know and affordability Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. and Bintang is the national beer for Bali Whew. did you all see Need that just that. now wife of life was riding a scooter <laughs> <laughs> yeah Trying. definitely you know yeah you have to the thing with that is they say it's like riding a bike but with a bike you use two brakes both brakes right depending on the on this situation and the scooter <clears throat> you know it's, it's just like riding a bike but i said to her to eliminate the front brakes while learning you know after you kind of like know what you're doing yeah. then you'll know how to use the front brake because just like a bicycle when you use only the front brake the back tipped yeah, over tips so as I was learning what I kind of said to myself psychologically if I panic just let go the right hand side yeah. period because that's where the gas is and sometimes I, I tense and hold on to it and not yeah. realizing that I'm still giving it some gas, some gas. so <laughs> but it's good when in Bali learn to ride a bike mm. definitely yeah. We decided mm -hmm. that we're gonna record this bit because I promised her that one day I'll be able to lift her up again. <laughs> Here it is. Yay. I wanted everybody to witness. And twirly. Yes. There we go. Yeah. This villa will be a shame to be here mm -hmm. and not take <laughs> advantage it, of this villa. Yes. I have to announce it. I was just giving him a Spike Lee moment right there. <laughs> no, Spike Lee doesn't do 360. Spike Lee goes. Spike Lee give you. Body camera. <laughs> <laughs> so this is pretty much our day for today. Mm -hmm. We're just going to chill, <laughs> relax, keep her afloat. <laughs> this area over here, this is where Jay was supposed to be staying. Yeah. It's a whole suite. It's a little private yeah. area. Bedroom, like a studio type setting. 
outdoor shower and everything. And and that's our area there, which you guys already know from seeing the previews. Yes. You know, but that's the current situation at the moment. Gonna get wet. <laughs>